Howdy folks and welcome back to the channel of the house that never sleeps. <laughs> I've got a couple of my buddies here with me today I want to introduce to you. Uh, two of my best buddies in fact these boys are. Uh, Jove here is my youngest grandson and he's got a birthday coming up before too long. He's almost five years old ain't you? And Reese just had a birthday. He's bigger than I am, and he just turned 12, just recently had a birthday. Uh, they're in the necklaces, as you can see. They both got their necklaces on. These are uh, bear claws out of uh, one of the bears that I killed. What's yours got, Reese? Wolf tooth. A wolf tooth on it. I didn't kill the wolf, but I fixed the necklace. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, we got some viewer mail coming up. And a few things to tell you about uh, why I'm behind on everything. And um, I'll just all kind of good stuff. So let's get into this viewer mail. And uh, anything you boys want to say to the 12,000 subscribers I have? Thank no? you for su subscribing. <laughs> yes, thank, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing. There you go, folks. We are grateful to you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's get into this mail thing and see what we got. So hold on. Tell them, boys. Hold, hold on. on. <laughs> so, like I say, I uh, got some viewer mail here from the asylum. I'll tell you about that in a minute. Um, a lot of questions been going on on Facebook uh, in private messages. People asking me about... Uh, telling me their instrument problems and asking me you know maybe how to fix it or and I get a lot of pictures of instruments that uh, need some uh, repairs or whatever done to them some love or whatever uh, so I thought I'd mention that if you have an instrument that you would like me to repair or look at or evaluate um, there's a couple of ways we can do it if you send me your instrument and you pay shipping and I evaluate it for free tell you what it, you know I'll charge you to fix it and if you don't want me to fix it or just uh, you know if it's too much or whatever you change your mind or you just want an evaluation or an idea you pay shipping again and I send it back to you just like it was unfixed okay if you send me one to evaluate and you pay shipping and you send it to me and I do repair it um, I'll pay the shipping in, re in the return back to you I feel that's uh, only fair because you know there's so many people that ask me you know how can I fix this or I've got uh, like I don't know um, a nut slot too deep for instance how do you tell someone to fix that I mean you know if they're wanting 18 thousandths gap at the first fret action or nut action as it's called or whatever you know I can tell you how to, to mix super glue and uh, baking soda if you want to go that route and feel the, feel the uh, slot and file it back out but you know you got to file it the right gauge for whatever string it is I can tell you how to do all that uh, it's just much easier though if I have the instrument here and I can see it, you know, I'm just using that as an, an example. There's a zillion other things can go wrong, but, uh, you know, as an example, I'm just saying, if I can see the instrument and look at it, I can give you an exact amount of what I would charge to fix it. And like I say, if you don't want to fix or for whatever reason, uh, you, you pay for the shipping and I'll send it back to you uh, untouched. Uh, but if, if you do want me to fix it, if we decide, you know, that I do, uh, you do want me to repair it and the price and everything, then I'll pay the shipping uh, on that instrument back to you. So you're only paying shipping one way. Anyways, that's cleared up. We got viewer mail, and I am anxious to get into this. Um, this was sent to me by uh, Looney Larry. I don't want to give away, uh, well, I, I don't want to give his too much info away on him. Um, he's got a YouTube channel, Looney Larry TV is his username. I think that's his username. But anyways, look him up. Uh, he's got all kind of stuff goes on on his channel. He does music. He does um, home brewing. Uh, just very interesting channel to watch. Yeah, the, the guy's just a wonderful man. Uh, I'm sure if you like my channel, I really think you'll like his as well. 
So, anyways, that's who this package is from. Let's uh, open her up. See what she is. It's heavy. Whatever it is, it's heavy. So we got uh, bubbles, peanuts. Man, you gotta love peanuts. I may be eating those peanuts before the night is over. There appears to be. Uh, you know, now that I think about it, I've got a pretty good idea what this is. Uh, there appears to be several of them in here. So let's just pop her open and see see what's inside. I'm like a kid at Christmas time with this stuff, man. Every time I get viewer mail, I just freaking go nuts. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. I may have to go get my glasses. I do have to have my glasses. I can't see this shit. This is too cool, man. This is too cool. Hold on. I gotta go get my glasses. This is just too cool, dude. Okay, what do we have here? Babylon Creek Homebrew. I'm not gonna tell you where Larry is located. Uh, you can look him up on... Uh, on YouTube, as I said, uh, Looney, Looney Larry TV is his uh, username. Uh, so let's look through here. Let's look at some of these. I'm sure that uh, there's going to be many things on his channel that you are absolutely going to love. If you're not subscribed to him already, go there and subscribe and uh, support Larry. Let him know that you are behind him. He's got a, a wonderful channel. I really enjoy his videos. I watch them, every one. Watch every one of them. I don't know if I've missed... Well, since I subscribed, I don't think I've missed any of his videos. And I even went back and watched um, a lot of them that he had put up before I had subscribed. German Style Unfiltered Wheat Ale. This is so cool, man. Check that out. I, don't know, I hope you can see. I hope the light's not glary because that's a really bright light. But, wow, man, that looks good. Hey, you know what? It couldn't have been at a better time either because I'm on my last course. This is the last course in the house that never sleeps. So, Larry, you just... Uh, <laughs> this came at a wonderful time, man. It came at a perfect time. Um, anyways, Larry does uh, home brewing, obviously, and he does uh, some music stuff. He's uh, he's done some music repair, uh, musical instrument repair stuff. Uh, he's got a video. One, one of his videos, he had a guitar, an electric guitar with the uh, the neck was actually twisted on the guitar. So he. Um, He put the neck in a vise, I think, if I remember right, and uh, used one of the keys and a string and pulled the, pulled the neck, twisted it to where it was straight, and left that under tension. I think he put heat on it, too, and uh, it worked out. It was perfect, man. Straightened that neck right out. Okay, hang on a minute. Let me show you what all we got here, man. This is so cool. Now maybe we can get a little better look at this. Man, these are beautiful, Larry. They oh wow, dude. Check this out. I'm trying to get it in the light where you can see it. Maybe where you can actually read it, I hope. There you go. I think you can see that. Uh yeah, man. You guys gotta turn to Larry's channel and check him out. I've watched him make some of these. And, well, I don't know if it was these actual ones or not, but I watched him uh, make uh, some brew, uh, several different types. I think this is the German one. Yeah. This is the one. Uh, <laughs> my people, my family's from Germany, so probably going to like this one best. I don't know. But I do know I'm definitely going to try these out. And we have uh, this one. There you go. I hope that glared. I hope you can see that okay. 
so cool man that really looks mm, I wish it was cold I'd drink it right now so uh, huh, I can't believe the timing on this man this chorus bottle is like maybe half empty or full depending on how you look at things um, and I apologize for the fan noise our air condition went south today God we've been getting unbelievable unbelievable temperatures and high humidities and just crazy crazy weather it's been so funky here weather wise downpours man that just you know create rivers where water doesn't even flow so hang on a minute let me uh, reset things here I got some announcements to make and I want to talk about the uh, Asylum a little bit more so hold on a World of insanity filled from ramblings from a madman you got to check uh, Looney Larry TV out you got to check him out watch his channel and watch how he makes this man I don't know a lot about home brewing. I want to learn uh, the more I watch his channel the more I want to learn to do this uh, but I do see really good uh, carbonation in every one I mean just sitting there warm at that I mean in these blistering temperatures that we've been having so uh, man Larry I can't thank you enough brother I love you man thank you uh, this old course was getting kind of uh, you know after you drink a certain beer for a certain period of time you want to something different something else this is perfect man couldn't have timed it out any better Thanks, brother. A uh, couple of things I wanted to mention, too, why I haven't got the uh, Cattle in the Cane video up yet. Well, I'll show you some footage near the end of this video. I don't know if the cue ball, she was here a few minutes ago. She must have left. Anyways, uh, I've been covered up, folks. I have been uh, covered up in both instrument repair and uh, just daily life shit, you know? like the old saying goes life gets in the way well that's pretty much it <laughs> I don't think it could be any crazier than it's been for the past two or three weeks and I'm not you know pissing and moaning about it it's okay I just hope it slows down real soon um, <laughs> like I say I'll show you some footage at the end of this video a little bit of just a little one thing but it's big that's been going on and instrument repair I've had so much of it I haven't been videoing any of it because you know I'm just trying to stay afloat trying to stay caught up trying to keep up with it haven't turned anything down yet but uh, man it seems like everyone's instruments all of a sudden blew up something happened to their instruments anyways uh, Cattle in the cane, I haven't forgot that, and I learned it, I can do it, I should have done it already by now, but just been, like I say, buried alive. But I wanted to make that announcement too, if you uh, have an instrument you'd like me to evaluate, or give you an estimate on, you know, you pay the shipping to and fro, and uh, if I don't fix it, and uh, you know, the only price you have in evalu evaluation is the sh shipping charges to and fro <laughs> so and if I do fix it um, like I say you pay the shipping send it to me if we come to an agreement you want me to repair your axe um, I'll pay the shipping on the return of the instrument back to you so anyways want to get that out of the way that's been coming up on Facebook a, a lot uh, lately so uh, that's uh, all I can think of right now that I wanted to say. Cattle in the Cane's coming, I promise. I really uh, am going to get that video up for you. I promise you it's coming. I'm just not really... The videos may be a little bit slower than they've been, you know, for a short while. Like I said, my daughter uh, bought a new house. She's moving. I don't know if I said that yet or not. Well, anyway, that's one of the things. Uh, She's been moving, we've been moving her stuff and the timing of the way it all worked out she found this deal on the house and she had to be out of the place she was in at a certain date and was trying to buy the house 
before that date came up so she could move from her old place to the new place. Of course, it, we missed it one day. Moved all her stuff out of her old place and stored it everywhere. And uh, the next day, she got the house. So anyways, we had everything in storage then. Actually, it was three days of moving. And she got the house on the, the last day of moving, the third day. So now we got to move the stuff again. <laughs> And that's just one of the things out of many, 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 many things that's just been tying me up, you know. And like I say, I've been getting all kinds of instrument repair from everywhere. And uh, even local stuff, you know, too. A lot of local stuff, actually, right now. For some reason, I don't know if it's this funky humidity we've been having. I don't know what it is, but... <laughs> So, uh, anyways, go to uh, Looney Larry TV here on YouTube. Look him up. Support him. Subscribe and watch. You will love this guy, man. He is cool. He is definitely. Well, here's the proof. You know, check that out. I'm going. I wish there was a way I could just make that cold. You know, like snap your fingers and it'd be cold. <sighs> I'm going to drink one of those tonight if I have to do it warm. Because I'm just about done with this. <laughs> so anyways folks that's uh, that's what's going on with the channel and uh, you know things going on right now I'm catching up I'll get caught up eventually uh, it won't be very long and get videos rolling again might not be a repair video it might not be a music video it might not even be a viewer mail shit I don't know what it might be man I really don't know could be anything I might try to make some of this stuff and video that that would be a disaster, <laughs> me trying to do this. Larry, thank you again, buddy. I appreciate this, man. Thank you so very much. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next video. Here's some footage of some of the crap, uh, just a little tiny bit of crap that's been going on uh, off camera. Well, I guess it was on camera because I filmed it. You wouldn't be able to see it. Uh, I don't know. It's just... Uh, yeah, let me show you this. Hold on. Hold on just a second. got to show you this, too. This is another thing been occupying lots of my time. Computer shit. I don't know. I used to work on computers. I may have told you. No, I don't think I had that video up yet. I used to have a computer business. I built computers specifically to how... Um, the customer wanted them built. They wanted so much RAM or so much video memory or a, a dual core, quad core processor or certain pro however they wanted the machine built. This was years ago, many years ago, but obviously as you can see I've still got uh, people still want me to work on their computers all the time. I need one of those shirts that says no I will not work on your computer i got to get one of those, or a cap or something. Anyways, um, that's all I can think of with all the madness going on. It's just a hard, really, hard, and heat, and, and the AC going out. Crazy, man. Anyways, I'll catch up. I will catch up. I'll get you the cattle and the cane video. And uh, right now, I'm going to get these cooled down. And check those out. So check Larry out. Check Larry out. Check him out, dudes and gals. I'll see you guys very soon. Thanks Larry again man. I appreciate it buddy. Cheers. Y'all stay cool. I'm only going to show you a couple of buildings <laughs> that we've filled up. Uh, you can see I'm in the sunlight and I can't already see the uh, screen because it's so bright out here. It's like in the 90s today. But anyways, if you can see back in that building, this is only one building, keep in mind. If you can see all that, that's what I've been doing. That's the reason videos are a little slow right now. And the reason I'm moving a whole lot slow right now. Uh, we've got fires built, burning brush, uh, mowing grass, and this, moving. My daughter uh, bought a house and uh, 
this is her stuff. She had to move it in buildings, storage, until uh, everything was complete and finalized on the house, which has been done now, which means we got to move all this stuff again, hopefully on a cooler day. Anyways, there you have one building. Uh, let me show you another one. Hold on. So, here we are, building number two. Man, I'm standing in the light. I can barely... Yeah, I can see a little bit. It get, kind of give you an idea. <laughs> this is the second building. Let me get over here where you can see. Uh, you can see all this good stuff that we've been moving. Like I say, my daughter bought a house and uh, they couldn't finalize the deal quick enough. So we put our stuff, you know, in scattered it throughout the family's outbuildings <laughs> and uh, wouldn't you know the very next day the bank finalized the deal and uh, keep in mind we just did get all this crap in here too like uh, yesterday and the day before and today now we gotta move it again so uh, <laughs> you gotta love it man back into the 90 plus degrees and uh, let's go to work I gotta film her when she will let me, when I can. She's bird hunting, I think. Yep, she sees one. What is it, cue ball? Cue ball, what do you say? Get him. Eat him up. Killer dog right there. Killer dog, man. 